Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Far Away. Um, let's start on this pickup truck. We left off on already removing everything, the moldings, the trims, the rubbers, and everything. So I'm working on the dents right now. Let me take you to the process on uh, fixing a couple of little dents. I already showed you how to look for them on the previous video. If you guys uh, want to check it out, I'll leave a link below to the previous video. And... Uh, check that one out so let's get to it Alright guys, uh, you see me working on the truck, sanding it, I'm sanding it with the DA with a 320 grit sandpaper. You can do the whole vehicle that you're doing with the DA if you have good control of it. All these curves and all that, if you don't have good control, you're going to notice the markings of the DA. Um, or if you don't have good control, just do it on the flat areas, do it on the flat areas and then go uh, get yourself a soft... Uh, soft rubber uh, sanding block and do the, the the round areas with the soft sanding block don't do it with your bare hands you're gonna notice it uh, don't get the sandpaper with your bare hands and uh, start sanding you're gonna notice the, the the waves and the paint job so get yourself one of these they're not that expensive and uh, do it like that another thing I wanted to show you guys is that the front of the truck has been painted previously not the back the back is from the factory the thing is that i don't know at the factory they added real little paint i have 320 on the on the da and i'm reaching the the sealer of the paint real quick you can see right here the self-etch primer then the sealer and all that which 
uh, either the paint is already burnt real bad um, and or uh, it, they just added real little paint I don't know how much they added at the at the factory but uh, that's what it is what it is so what I'm gonna be doing I'm gonna start sanding as much as possible you can see here that I kind of went all the way but uh, that's the way I'm gonna do it um, that's another little tip guys that don't use your bare hands don't uh, you have good control like I said with the DA do it with the DA um, let me continue and I'll bring you back once uh, everything sanded uh, this side didn't have that many dents had little there's one right there I still need to work on the body filler but uh, the hood is the one that had more so I'm waiting on this to dry it's not uh, that dry yet so uh, like I said this truck didn't have that much so let me continue sanding the whole truck I don't want to show you bore you with that so let me do this and I'll bring you back once uh, I'm gonna work on the other side of the dance and all that All right, you saw how I did the top. I still need a little bit more, but right now I'm gonna start working on these uh, little dents that I circled over here so that I can show you how to do them. Um, this, like I said, this truck had almost no dents. It's just little door dings here and there. But uh, let me show you how to get those done and uh, let's get this truck ready. Everything else is just done the hood is done I just need to primer it and uh, I still need to put uh, start uh, wet sanding all this area so uh, let me continue All right, guys you saw how I sanded the surrounding area first I sanded it with uh, 220 then um, I went with the angle grinder and I started grinding the inside where the dent is where the the sandpaper didn't get uh, you need to scratch everything out so that the body filler can stick to the to the panel the right way so uh, also you saw me sand this the door handle which I need to sand it down anyway so I'm gonna paint it red everything's gonna be red on this side so uh, it's there's no problem with that okay so let me start adding the body filler and then I'll start uh, smoothing, smoothing the body filler down so that uh, the dent is uh, no more
All right, guys, you saw me adding the body filler and uh, I'm just letting it, letting it set uh, before I start uh, sanding it. Um, other than that, I'm just gonna fix those dents that are left and start sanding these two doors and uh, the rest of the pickup truck so that I can start uh, wet sanding the whole thing and have it ready for paint. Alright guys, the body work's done. Now what I'm gonna do is uh, put some primer on that body work and uh, wet sand the entire truck. Okay, the truck was D8 with 320. I used the D8 for the entire truck with 320. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna wet sand with 400 and 600. 600 will be the last one and the truck will be ready for paint. So um, I still need to, like I said, wet sand the entire truck. So um, that'll be in the next video, guys. I'm not going to show you the wet sanding process. Uh, so when, when I bring you back, it's going to be the uh, truck's going to be covered and ready to spray. Okay, that'll be the next video. And guys, this will be it for this video, guys. So like the video, share the video, subscribe. If you're not a subscriber, hit the link below. Help me out if you can. Hit the little bell icon so you can be notified whenever I upload a video. And this is it for this video, guys. Also, I'm going to be using that gun, that Warwick uh, 990 HE on this, on this truck. So look out for that one also. And uh, guys, have a great week, and God bless.